Helping you pick up girls? That's our dangerous mission? It is tonight, number one. Now, keep your eyes out for the rarest of birds, the plump Asian skank. Well, unfortunately, everyone here is tall and gorgeous. Ah, <sighs> true. I guess I'll just have to settle for some tight white meat. Excuse me? Are you from Tennessee? Cause you're the only ten I see. Other than this one, which is yours to earn. Ah! Maybe we should try someplace else. I've been so lonely since my poor wife was taken hostage in Fallujah. But why not go get her, sir? I will not negotiate with terrorists. Oh, I can only imagine the monstrous things those Sunni insurgents are doing to my poor sweet Miriam. I'm afraid she's doomed to die alone. As am I. And that fat dude in the cape. You're not alone, sir. You have AJ. Ah, oh, I love the boy, but I'm afraid he's part of the problem. Whenever I do manage to find a girl willing to overlook my age, they bolt at the sight of the baby. The whole cradle-to-grave thing in one look really freaks women out. Besides, every time I look at AJ, I'm reminded that he has no mother and I have no mate. Without a woman in our lives, AJ and I will never truly be a family. That's terrible, sir. Is there anything I can do to help? Actually, just having someone to talk to gives me enormous comfort. I'm happy to do it, sir. Mm -hmm. mm. <coughs> vroom, vroom. Oh, yeah. I'm a squirrel, and that feels great. <laughs> been up with that baby five nights in a row. If I have to sit through one more Carson Daly, oh, I get it, you're friends with Dave Navarro. What now? Klaus! He bumped into the coffee table. I looked away for two seconds. <sighs> I can't find my dinosaur stickers. Well, you'll have to look for them yourself. AJ has a boo-boo. I have a bobo too. You did that on purpose. <laughs> Roger, what the hell? Isn't it obvious? Sibling rivalry. Roger's jealous of the new baby in the house, so he's acting out. Yeah, what makes you such an expert? Joe Mama. Well played. There's my little Pisha. Did you sleep well? He didn't sleep at all. He's not a football, Avery. You can't keep passing him off to me every night and picking him up in the morning. It's not good for him. <sighs> You're right. It would be easier for all of us if I left him here during the day, too. Cheerio, Junior. Backskate. Stan, how can you let him do this to me? I'm not his permanent babysitter. You need to say no to your boss. I can't. Number ones don't say no. Besides, it's just until I can find a woman for Avery. That could take forever. The guy's a weirdo. No woman's going to be interested in him. That's not true. He had a wife. <gasps> That's it. His wife. <gasps> <gasps>